Tabular data are the most common form of structured data we use for analysis and data science. But what are tabular data and how do we organize our data in this way? Tabular data are data organized into a table. A table provides the data with structure. A table is a two-dimensional grid of data. However, unlike a matrix, which we saw earlier, all of the elements in a table do not need to be of the same data type. Rather, all data in each column must be the same data type, which we refer to as homogeneous data. However, all data in a row can have a different data type from column to column, which we refer to as heterogeneous data. For example, imagine we have a table of patients at a hospital. We'd have a set of rows, one for each patient, and a set of columns, one for each attribute of the patient. Each element of data in a column must be the same data type. For example, all of the names must be character strings, all of the genders must be an enumeration of male, female, or other genders, all of the ages must be integers, and so on. However, each row contains elements of various data types. For example, the name Bill is a character string, the gender male is an enumeration, and the age 21 is an integer. As we can see, each column contains only a single data type. However, each row can contain multiple data types. In data science, tabular data can be broken down into three main components. Observations, which we locate on the rows of a table, variables, which we locate on the columns of a table, and relationships, which connect data from one table to data in another table. We'll discuss each of these components in more detail next.